And I'm just going to show you. This is my new box to give me more base. It's ported on the corners to give you that extra boom. And I don't want to say it's twice the size of my other one. It is. But it pretty much, yeah. I mean, it goes all the way back. The seat wouldn't go down in the back of my my Dodge Ram. So what we did is we we shimmed the seat up with some washers. Just about three of your standard size washers. And let's just bring it up maybe, I don't know if you can see that, maybe a quarter of an inch, maybe a little more. That way my seat can come all the way down. So right now she's just fixing stuff that the, uh, that the um, electrical place kind of messed up on me. They just yanked it and just ripped the, ripped the carpeting. She's repositioning them because I always keep my truck looking nice. So let's see what she's doing over there. She's just re-putting them in there. Let me know when you're ready and then we're going to put this back in so I can show it on YouTube here. Because, I mean, I didn't know. If I knew we could have got this size box in the beginning, I would have been a lot happier. Because it definitely got more boom. I mean, before my, my stereo was loud, but it just didn't have that overall thump. And this one definitely does. All right, you ready to put it in yet, or? Yeah, one more. All right. I don't want to go too long There's to make this. There's wires in. here. That's why. Sorry. Don't pull on the wire, whatever you do. See the wire? All right, put it in, Lee. So yeah, but you gotta remember. We, okay. We gotta remember. We gotta put it back in too. Yeah. Down. You don't want to yank the wires out. Yeah, Alright, now we're good. I'm going to try to position the camera so we can put this back in. I'm going to get my mom right here to hold it. No, don't worry. Ready? Let's go. Let's put it back in. We got to pick oh, it up. Look inside here. I know. Come on. I know. I see That's it. why it's hollow out. Ready? It's what they call ported, I guess. So, ready? I got to pick that end up. Yeah. Slide it in. Carefully. We're not pulling the wires, right? Nope. Get the wires under there. Get wires. Lay it down. Okay. Nice and easy. All right. There it is. All right. Let me show. Baby's in. Let me show YouTube here. That's out of here. And Baby's in. Q-bomb. I mean, this, this. And. It's, it's tight, but it's, it's better than it was. Because I couldn't even put the seat down. I always keep my seat covered so it doesn't get dirty. Well, that's a lot better. I, I can live with this now. The, and I'll leave the speaker. The heads are a little bit and I can higher. leave the speaker covers on there. I don't care about damaging the bottom of the seats. I I rather damage the bottom of the seat than damage the speaker. That's a lot better. Before, I could only get this down like to here. It but went, when we pitched this went, up, when we pitched this up, here. yeah, that's how the seat would stay before. Now close it down. That's a lot better. Pop it up. Let me see my covers. Make sure my covers will be okay. They took my covers off to make it more flatter. But I think you think leaving it on there will be okay now. Without putting screws in it, it should be fine. Yeah, I think it'd be fine so too. So this is tight. I, I tried to get that one out. All right. I can't even get it Just out. want to show you guys on YouTube this. This is for 2012 Dodge Ram Quad Cab um, with the rigid industry bars. We're going to Showtime's Metal Work Bar bumper. We're waiting for it right now. Fuel rims, 35, 7 inch lift kit. Got my body lift over here. As soon as I can put my body lift in, it's going to bring it three more inches. And. We should be good. All right, let's pack it up. Let's go get some meat.